Lenten Reflection and Prayer Day 28 Dear brethren, let us journey with the Lord on His Passion for forty days. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, Amen. Let us reflect on this scripture. Praise be to the God and Father of our Lord Jesus Christ. In His great mercy, He has given us new birth into a living hope through the resurrection of Jesus Christ from the dead. The scripture reading for today reminds us of the hope that we have as Christians. We are given new birth into a living hope through the resurrection of Jesus Christ from the dead. Jesus didn't get stuck in the grave. If He did, we would have been hopeless. He rose from the dead. That gives us hope and assurance. This hope sustains us through the trials and challenges of life and gives us the courage to face our fears and to persevere through difficult times. It is a hope that is grounded in the reality of the resurrection, which gives us confidence in the power and love of God. As we journey through this season of Lent, let us remember that our hope is not in our own abilities or accomplishments, but in the grace and mercy of God. Turn towards the light of Christ, who offers us a new life, and hold fast to the hope that you have in Him, and trust that He will guide you through life. Let us give thanks to the God and Father of our Lord Jesus Christ for the great gift of new birth and living hope that He has given us through the resurrection of Jesus Christ. May we hold fast to this hope, and may it give us strength and courage as we continue our journey of faith. Amen. Prayer for Lenten Grace Loving God, during the sacred season of Lent, bring me closer to you. Prepare a place in my home and heart for silence and solitude, so that I may rediscover the grace of a prayerful life. Help me to fast from those things that threaten the well-being of body and soul, and remind me of the grace of simplicity. Enlarge my heart so that I give to those in need, and in so doing, Ray discover the grace of gratitude and generosity. May this season be a grace-filled time to rekindle my love for and faith in you. Amen. Dear brethren, in this season of Lent, we appeal to you to remember the words of Jesus. Whatever you do to the least of my brethren, that you do unto me. Help us to provide limbs for people with disabilities who are also financially disadvantaged by sending a super thanks or using the link in the description. Thank you. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, Amen. Oh, you see the